All right, man. Yes, sir. All right, man. What what we looking like over there? We looking a little bit better. I'm in the city now, so yeah. I should have. A, yeah, I, I should be real I just, good. I got past Flagstaff. That's usually my baddest point. Okay. For a while. Okay. All right. So back to Pitney Bowles, man. Uh, uh, nah, man. Nah, I. <laughs> a year experience or coming. You say coming out of, and that's just a rumor, coming out of school. Now, if they coming out well, of see, school, they, if they, they haven't they haven't started that yet. Now right. I don't know if they'll have something different for uh, students that graduate, mm -hmm. but right now we on our pay scales only run based on the length of the run. Like the one that I was doing to uh, Greenwood, Indiana, it was on an eighty thousand dollar pay schedule. So these, so okay. this is just certain. Uh, the lanes that you guys choose comes with different pay schedules, right? Based upon you know mileage, stuff like that. Okay. Like the one that I did for eighty thousand. Even though I was getting, uh, even though Andrew was getting paid the eighty thousand, they were still paying me on the schedule that I signed up for, which was the ninety-two thousand. And I was, and that run only worked three days. We would leave on Sunday, and we were back Tuesday morning. Wow! So again, this is—is is this every two weeks on a Friday, or every two weeks throughout? Every the two weeks on a on a Friday. Our our pay cycle ends on Sunday. All right. So how you know how how these guys you know well guys you know you guys are gonna have to get used to getting paid every two weeks if. If y'all coming in from a company that's being paid every week, how do you right. how, how do you suggest that these people mentally uh, prepare themselves for a, a bi week? Put it on paper. Check? Put it on paper. Budget. Mm -hmm. If you see it, it's easier to it's easier to manipulate it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, manipulation, but it's easier to understand. This every uh, there we go again. You 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 breaking up again. You are breaking up. Sound like uh, so, sound like uh, the sis me. Sound like the sis me and dollar man over there, bro. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Still sound, still, still sounding like the sis me and dollar man. You you're, you're, uh, you're breaking up. You're breaking up. You break. Wait. Hold on. Let me make sure that's not me. Hold on, right quick. Why? Why I'm tripping? Hold on, right quick. Let me make sure that's not. Okay. I'm still in. I'm still in 5G status. Why my? Why my phone ain't turning around? But, yeah, my. I'm in 5G as well. Yeah. Can you hear me again? Oh, there you go. I I hear you now. Okay. Yeah, I I got at least three good bars. Okay. Uh, but yeah, brother, the best to me, the best way is to budget and write it on paper. Mm -hmm. I use a matter of fact. Not just because it's two weeks. You could do this with anything. But I use this. Uh, uh, it's not necessarily an app. But there's a website called True Bill. Mm -hmm. And you don't necessarily have to pay. It works off of donations. Even if you want to do $3 a month or $5 a month or whatever. But it, it lets you see. You basically put all of your bills, all your expenses, uh, all the money that you have coming in. And it basically gives you graphs on how you're spending your money. Mm. It's called True Bill. Just go to TrueBill.com. Okay, okay, that's what's up. So, your your first paycheck, man. When 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 do the people inspect their first paycheck? Because uh, usually some companies like well, to it keep depends the on when they we they don't do holes. They don't do holes at all. Okay. Yeah, so like, okay, like I get paid this coming Friday. Right. So So is it like the, uh, so is it like the first and the fifteenth or is it like the first week and the middle of the week or something like that? Because sometimes they say you get paid like twice a month, but then you also get paid, you know, you get paid three times a month, you know, like every right. two weeks. Because uh, we I think we have we have one of those coming up uh what is it, October? Mm -hmm. Where we get three checks in one month. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So it's it's like it's like that. So it's not like it's not like twice uh, a month, like the first and the fifteenth, or the fifteenth and the thirtieth. 
So. No, it ain't. It ain't a. It ain't a public assistance check. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 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 So, brother man, um, Pitney Bowles, man. So, um, so people coming up in their union. I mean, uh, coming up in there with the urine test. They passing that. They good to go. Uh, they can either choose teams or 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 go solo. They can choose their own lanes and the amount of the uh uh that's paying for that lane. Now you giving a right. lot of you you giving a lot of pros, man. You know pros and cons. You giving a lot of pros, man. You you have yet to say any cons though, man. Uh, is that well, because only... is that is that because you only been there for six months and you you haven't uh experienced anything yet and i i know, you know this what? is everything from your experience because it's you know of everybody course. experiences is is going to be different but from your experience so far man you you haven't experienced any cons yet the only thing that i would consider a con at this point but it's kind of beyond uh penny bowl's control is the fact that like I haven't gotten my new truck yet, right? But, I mean, I'm still in a 2019, but, you know, when I first started, we had a brand new truck. So Andrew and his wife are now in that truck. That truck had a hundred and something miles on it or two, no, about 400 miles, whatever it was. It was real low in the hundred miles. And, but, but that's not Pitney Bowles' fault. Because once again, we lease our trailers and our trucks from Penske, okay. and so Pit and do, and and to our it's it's kind of you know Pitney Bowles is a big company with pop in their lane, but when it comes to trucking, you know we might only have maybe four or five hundred truck top with uh with, and that's including sleepers and uh sleepers and day cabs. And maybe even the 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 straight trucks that we have too. So we don't have the clout that you know a Swift or a Snyder or somebody that's gonna come in and buy or or come in and get you know 2,500 units all at once. So we kind of in the back of the line, and they and and uh, Pinsky is keep telling us you know hey it's manufacturing problems. They're not due to the pandemic, you know truck, but I, I see the piggybacks out here that companies are buying are buying trucks, but it's like maybe you know I and, and again this is my personal opinion. Nobody official has told me this, but it's like we're not big enough to to be first in line, so to speak. Mm. Okay. You know, hopefully hopefully we grow and get there. But like I said, there's nothing wrong with this truck. It's a 2019. It's got 307 thousand miles on it. You know. All right, so uh, so if 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 drivers are interested in driving for the company, um, do do the company have uh, have uh, like lease options? Uh, lease options? No, there? this is this is a uh, uh this is all company. But I don't have the information with me. They did give me some some brokers mm -hmm. like uh, I don't let's see. I'm trying to remember that list. I sent it to somebody, but there's three brokers that they use if a if a you know if somebody has their own truck and okay. stuff. So, but the so but the I, company I'll get don't, that information to you. The comp the company don't they they don't have no lease options there. They just strictly W two. No. Right. All right, Lawrence, man. Uh, how, how long you been driving all together? Uh, I got my class A on August the fifth of night of two thousand. 10 so a little over coming up on what is this 11 years okay okay in a, in a couple of days okay so do you see yourself retiring from pitney bowls uh more than likely i have a i got i have a, like a seven-year plan mm -hmm. i'm probably going and i i told them coming in i'm gonna stay here about seven years maybe maybe longer but definitely seven years I can I can see myself staying here because I got some other plans uh, down the pike about seven years out. So, so but, yeah, I may stay here after that. 
I so, don't know. So you mentioned in the beginning of uh, you know, uh, uh, in the beginning of this conversation, that uh, Pitney Bowles right out the gate has uh has good medical insurance and everything, uh, right out the gate. Um, well, the name. Now I don't know how good the insurance is, but what I'm saying, the companies that they use, they're reputable companies. Kaiser, UHP, mm-hmm. Aetna. Mm-hmm. Uh, I think they might even have Blue Cross Blue Shield, and they got and they got uh, Delta Dental. But this, uh, they have. But uh, this, but this I'm is sorry? A, But this is available for people right out of the gate, though, like right after they get hired. Basically, well, basically, it's like like I said, if you got hired on the 15th of August, your benefits would have kicked in on the first okay. of September. Okay, that's what's up, man. That's what's up. Uh, oh, and then I forgot about the sign-on bonus. There's a two thousand dollar sign-on. Okay. And that how, is, how payable, is it, and that's how payable. How is it paid out? Ninety days in full. Oh, okay, that's what's up. That's what's up. Go, go. And and as bad as they need drivers, that might go up. <laughs> okay, okay. Because uh, that's the pro- that's the pro- the only problem. And again, that's not Penny Bowles. I've talked to several people, and the main problem is they don't believe that a, a, a trucking job is this easy and it's like like I said I don't do nothing they give you a company phone uh, they give you a little I have a little s10 that that's what your ELD is on wait wait wait, wait and stop. Then, stop. Oh, 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 oh okay you said they give it to you okay I, I was about to say bro they giving you a they, they giving you you got an s10 the hell yeah uh, yeah, that's what this, the, this I mean. Company, it worked. That, wait, wait, this is the company phone, right? Look at this dude. Right, it has, it has, uh, you know, it has my ELD on it. Right. Uh, you put it. They got this new app called uh, Workhound. It's mm-hmm. like a third party agency that, uh, you know, it's a third party agency that collects all the data from the drivers. That you know, they'll come on, they'll text you and say, Lawrence, you're the eyes and ears of the company. You know, we want to hear the good, the bad, the ugly, the indifferent. Mm-hmm. And believe me, they I'm so happy they gave me this platform. And I don't put anything down there bad. The only thing that I have put down there that might be a negative, but it's really not, is I said that, you know, our badges should work for more than just at our facility. My badge, I can get into the building at my facility, but when I get over here to New Jersey, this badge doesn't work. And then I said that each facility should have at least two showers, you know, that just in case somebody wants to take a shower while they wait for their load to get ready. Mm-hmm. Other than that, it's like the, the usual downfalls that you have at other companies like crappy dispatchers. I know what my job is. I got to run. So all I, let, me, let me tell you how my night goes. Tell me how your night goes, I, bro. I get to work. Okay, I get to work at about 11 o'clock on Wednesday night. Mm -hmm. I get to the truck. I inspect it, make sure, you know, do my pre-trip inspection. Right. I put all my, I put my little bit of gear in there because I done downsized to just two bags, basically. Mm -hmm. I put my gear in and then I go around to the, to the outbound gate. I'm in the same door every week. Uh, door 18. Mm Mm-hmm. I wait for them to load. The, the security guard brings me my paperwork. I sign it, my BOLs, and I close up shop. I use, I like to use a cargo net because sometimes some of the boxes are loose or some of the, the shrink wrap is kind of loose, so I don't want boxes all over the place. Mm-hmm. So I keep a cargo net with me. I, I close the doors. I seal it up. I get to the gate. I give them the, the, the salute, and we out. All right, so do so before you get in. Would you already know your load before you get there, or do they do they send you the load? Uh, uh, uh-uh. When when you my there? load is the same every week. Oh, it's about the location. It's about the location that you go to. Okay, you go to the same door dot door. When I get to New Jersey, I pull up to the gate. They take the paperwork. I'm all my license is already on file, so they don't need that. Right. I either go from either door 50 to 53. I put my trailer in the door. If they tell me they don't have no trailers, I wait for them to unload. I go around the door 136. And then they're loaded back. They're loaded. They're, they're loaded there. And then you already. They're loaded back up. Is, is that the turnaround point where you just 
just bring it back to where you originally came from, or do you have a, yeah. another? Oh, okay, so this is just a, a back and forth stop all through it's the night. It's basically like a drop. It's just like basically a drop and hook. All, all through the night? What you mean? Like, okay, so you, you, you pick up you, you pick up in one. Uh, you pick up in one, go and drop it, grab the other one, bring it back. And come back to California. And that and that's it? You you don't have to that that's it for the night? I do I do uh how how many runs? Like I said, how, how how many runs? It's just in the it's night? just it's a it's a round it's just a round trip from from California to New Jersey and back. Oh, okay. Yeah, there's the miles right there. So that's about how how many hours? About so, twenty seven about it's about it's about ninety hours round trip. That equates to about eighty four cents a mile if you wanna Put it to miles okay. or whatever. No, no, no. I was just, I, I was just thinking out loud that uh, once you get, so basically, you come on Monday, and you don't. No, get back. I, I come, I come to work. I, mean, I come to work out, Wednesday, okay. basically Wednesday night. So you Thursday, come, early Thursday morning. So and then we get back Monday morning about eh, traffic, whatever. Oh, we might get okay. back see that's about what I was, six o'clock. Yeah, see that's what I was talking about. That that's what I was talking about. So this is so you're you're out uh four, four least, days. Four basically. days. Okay. That's that's yeah. what I that's where I was getting at. So this ain't okay. no this ain't no home daily uh dropping hook here, then make it back dropping hook. These this is like long deep runs that'll keep yeah, you. Yeah, this is a team this is this is the team side. Now again, in certain locations, they have daily stuff. They get they get paid by the hour. Okay. And I'm not sure what the regional people get. They might get paid by the hour too. I'm not sure because right. I never looked into that. Now, I never looked. But I mean, they they got a run down in Texas out of Dallas right now. I'm trying to get fill for them. All it does is leave Dallas. It goes to Monroe, Louisiana. Then it goes to Lafayette, Louisiana, and it comes back to Dallas. That's a 16-hour turnaround with a team. So you home about five hours and still off on the weekend. Okay. And that one pays like 90. I think that one pays 90,000. Okay, that's what's up, man. That's what's up. All right, so before we get on up out of here again, Lawrence, man, I appreciate you coming in here, you know, giving a little background about uh about your company, Pitney Bowles. Uh, you know, of course, he, you know, he's a, he, he's, he's an old head in the game, but – a new jack at the company and you know we still you know we still hearing the good you know sound like the good is outweighing the bad over there but you know how it is with these uh hey i'm trying i'm trying to really think but man you know i you know you, me hey, i'm kind of laid wait, back wait 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 lawrence you, you you ain't doing this for the referral bonus are you 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 doing it you, for the referral bonus you you legit you legitimately Come, you know, come, you you legitimately reached out to me just to legitimately to get this information out there so that people can uh so that people can look towards Pitney Bowles as one of the companies having of choice. a good having a good job. I mean, yeah, you know the referral bonus. Yeah, I'll take the referral bonus, but at the same time, it's creating job security for me because if we don't have enough drivers, then we might not be in business. So Ooh, don't uh, yeah, talk about this Dylan. is called. Don't talk about Dylan now. Don't talk about Dylan. 40, 40 years in the game, and they just abruptly closed yesterday. <sighs> really? Uh, yeah, man. Is that right? Yes, sir. They, they, they. And uh, I just saw a sign that said they were hiring. <laughs> yeah, they, I, I, I'm, I'm, st I'm, I'm going through my, uh, I'm going through my, uh, my what do you call it? Uh, I'm going through my archives because I could have sworn. I, I I called them uh, doing one of the episodes, but I don't know. I reached out to a company called uh, Hilton uh, Hilton Hilton Transport. It's one of Dylan's. Yeah. It's one of Dylan's competitors, and they reached out on Facebook to uh, to the Dylan drivers, offering them a sweet ten thousand dollars sign on bonus for any Dylan driver that's been, you know, that been displaced. So I told, I, oh, wow. I, I was like, you know, for the Dylan drivers to come in, I was like, yo, tell them that you want that $10,000 out the gate. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know yeah, yeah. I, want, I want that 10000 out the gate. I don't want to wait no years. I don't want y'all to break it down. I, I did, did, give me the first five in the, in, in say like the, the, the 30 days. 
and give me my last five after the ninety days. That's what I'm talking about. Right. Give that, me my that sounds like G's. a good that sounds like a good breakdown. Give me my ten G's for that, man. So But yeah, man, but for real though, I, I really am trying to go through my job and and and, and tell you because I, I don't want nobody to be deceived, mm-hmm. you know, at all. And like I said, this is not a, a this is not a usual situation. Because like I said, when you got in-house stuff, it's a little bit different a game. You're worried about, you know, trying to find a broker and trying to find freight and all this other kind of stuff. Mm-hmm. That ain't our issue. Our issue right now is trying to find good, qualified, safe, dependable drivers. That That's where we're at. All right, that's what's up, man. Hey, what about what about drivers with felonies, man? Would they would they give them a chance? You 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 think? I w- I'm not. Uh, for the most. Uh, you 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 breaking out again? About ten years. Uh, hold on. Repeat that. You you broke out when you were saying that. I said I'm not sure, but most you know, I'm I'm pretty sure that's probably about the standard. You know, it's got to be about ten years old, and then also it depends upon uh, what it is. Okay. But hopefully we'll get to do a, a, a good uh, interview in the future, you know, and then all the big the, – the people that know everything can tell you. But like I said, I'm, I'm really trying to – matter of fact, when you post this, if I come up with something that I think that might be a con, because some people think that waiting up for the load is a con. So, I mean, that's all relative. So – you know, hey, yeah. I, I wish the load was ready when I get there. I, I'll but, I mean – I'll send you the link. Uh, so you can, uh, you know, post it to your social media. The only thing, the only thing that I require now uh, for people that I that I do uh, interviews with going into the future, you know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah. Just, you know, just every so often, you know, just every so often, you know, just check out, you know, the comments in the comment session, you know. So if somebody oh, yeah. if somebody come in there and 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 they ask a question or something like that you know i I, i'm not going to inspect you to you know look through it every you know every day but if you get well well, how about this i will i will give you or you can even attach my information yeah or what i'll do i will uh, i'll give you steve nichols yeah i'll i'll email you steve nichols information as well as the website that you would go to to find uh work for Pitney Bowes in your respective areas. How about All right, that? that'll work. Give me, yeah, send me the information. Uh, if any of the guys, if any of you guys is listening uh, to this uh, to this episode right here, the Pitney Bowes episode, um, if you guys are interested in what uh, Lawrence had to say about the company and you want to know more about it, make sure you check all the information in the uh, description below. And uh, and if you are interested in in the company, you know, you know, show some love to uh, Lawrence for getting the uh, getting the information out here, because I I, I think that uh, I think that Pitney Bowles is one of these uh, is one of these type of companies that um, that, you know, is kind of uh, kind of hold up ish, if I should say. They kind of, but you know what? I'm, I'm gonna tell you something about they, that they, too. They kind of hold they, they information uh, close to the chest type deal. But you know what? I, I'm gonna tell you something about that too. I think that you know, Pitney Bowes, they they they're looking to grow this thing mm-hmm. bigger than it's ever been, and I think they're gonna be a game changer because there are not too many jobs like this paying salary a good salary. You know, hopefully that becomes a, a industry standard where, you know, you got better jobs. Where if we break down, I'm not worried about mileage. They're gonna have me a. Tr- they're supposed to have me a truck out to me in a couple of hours. Ain't, ain't gonna be none of this. You know, I don't know what you're gonna do about your mileage pay. My check is still gonna be in my account come Friday. And, hey, hey, but the sad part about it, look, I just got my CB tweaked. And ready to go, but this particular truck <clears throat> doesn't have an antenna in it. I'm hoping my new one will, because I'm I'm ready. You know, for the longest of time, I didn't care for CBs because I didn't want to hear all that rhetoric that people was talking. But you know, after some of these accidents out here, it's best to have some kind of communication 
other than your cell phone. You know and what? Also, that's that's going to be that. That's going to be a whole. That's going to be a whole different topic. So hold, hold your thought on that one, bro. We we definitely going to come back on that. Uh, oh, so, and yeah. I want to say, you know, uh, you can even put my information. You can put my name and my number. If somebody finds something bad or that they dislike or don't understand, mm -hmm. give me a call. Uh, no doubt, no doubt, no doubt. So after, like I said, after every uh, after after our conversation today, make sure you uh, make sure you leave that for me, and uh, you know you can either better yet, uh, it probably might be better to shoot it through me to me through uh, email. But uh, other than that, man, I really do appreciate you coming on here. Uh, you know, talking about Pitney Bowles. Uh, Pitney Bowles been around for a uh, hundred years. Hopefully, uh, we'll be able to. You know, get a uh, get a conversation with uh, with Pitney Bowles directly, but you heard from a you heard from a, a a ten plus year driver that you know that's been there since the beginning of the year. You know, finding success uh, with Pitney Bowles uh, driving teams. Um, now, as far as the, the as far as the ninety k go, because you know you 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 stress that you you stress the ninety k. But you said you also drive in teams. So is that 90K going to the truck or is that 90K going to the individuals? No, 184,000 is coming to the truck if you want to think of it like that. Okay, so so you got so you get 90K well, to the truck. So you get 90K and your co-driver gets 90K. Ninety-two. Ninety-two. Get my two thousand dollars, bro. Okay, so okay, <laughs> because that's the, I. I just wanted to clarify that. I. I just wanted to clear. Yeah. I. I just wanted to clarify that. Uh, I. I just wanted to clarify that. It's. It's not a split. Ninety-two k. No. That's coming no. to the truck, and it's split between you and your co-driver. Yo. Your co-driver getting ninety-two. And you and get I'm 92. getting 92. Absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. Okay. 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 90, 92K, y'all. You know, teams or solo, you know, definitely uh, definitely find them out. Uh, yeah. Now, the solo stuff is probably going to be the reg more regional and local. But okay. the but the, uh, the team OTR, mm -hmm. you know, we the one that gets it wherever it needs to go because, like, uh, right now, they got a lane out of Vegas. They got our lane. They got one in Corona, California. They got one in Dallas. And then there's also a run, supposed to be a run going to um, uh, Jessup, Maryland. And hopefully sometime in the future, they'll have something going to the ATL from California. And then they'll have something going to, uh, I believe, Jacksonville, Florida. Okay, that's, that's what's up. kind of being talked about. So, they, you know, they're just trying to grow steadily. And, and get these lanes together. All right, that's what's up, man. Well, the, um, Lawrence, man, thank you for the good information. I really do appreciate it. Yo, support me with some coffee, man, because I'm 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 thirsty over here, bro. You do you still got my old uh old contacts? Do I do I need to let you know what my contacts is so you can give me some coffee, bro? Well, yeah, just just either just, just text it to me. What you want, Duncan? Uh, I, I I don't know, man. Whatever whatever you can whatever you can afford works for me, man. I, I'll go ahead and. Well, take don't that, say that. afford. It ain't like I was gonna buy you some copy luwak or nothing. Oh man, hey, <laughs> if, if you if you want to go to Starbucks and give me some of that good that good gourmet coffee, that'll work too, man. <laughs> hey, well in that case, hey, in that case, hey, in that case, I might get you what I got, man. I bought this beautiful bag of uh, Ethiopian coffee, man. It is bomb. Oh well, hey, whatever, whatever the amount that you want to send me for some coffee, man, it it works. Uh, I'll I'll uh, I I'll, I'll test that. Do you you do you have Cash App? Do, do you have a Cash App? I don't think you yeah. have. Oh, you do got you got one now. Well, I, I I had I wasn't using that other one. I didn't even have a card hooked up to it. I think. How did I do that? I forgot. I I think you I think you sent the one coffee to me via Zelle, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, I like I like Zell better. Okay, all right, all right. Yeah, I got you on that. I got you on that coffee. What about PayPal? Do you do you have PayPal? 
I do, but I don't use it that often. All right, then I tell you what, I'll, I'll just send you my Zelle information. All you, all you got to do is just use my. Uh, I think I, I think I already got it because it's oh, like okay. you know all I, oh, all I need a, is your yeah, phone number. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's in, if it's in your phone, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you you should have it. All right, man. So uh, again, thank you very much for coming on, man. I really do appreciate it. Uh, guys, yes, sir. Thanks for having me. Not a problem, guys. If y'all interested in Pitney Bowls, man, you know, check out the information that I got for you in the description. You know, give them a call. Uh, hey, and we got some ladies out here too. We got we got a a, a lady team as well too. Okay, so okay. Don't so, be bad. Don't be bashful. Okay, that's what's up. So give them a uh, give them a call. The information that you guys gonna need will be in the description. Lawrence, man, I appreciate you coming on, and we'll talk again soon. All right. Yes, sir, brother. Be safe out there. Take care. All right. Thanks now, for having me. Not a doubt. Peace. Later.